Hi guys, my name is Derek Jager, executive chef of The Cravery. And I'm gonna show you how to make thin and crispy oatmeal cranberry cookies. So first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is preheat your oven to 350 degrees and line some baking sheets with parchment paper and put those off to the side. First thing for this cookie, we're going to take seven ounces or 14 tablespoons of butter, one cup of regular granulated sugar, and one fourth cup of brown sugar, and we're gonna add that to the stand mixer. And we're going to get that starting to cream. While the butter and sugars are creaming, we can take our one cup of flour, three fourths tablespoons of baking powder, one half teaspoon baking soda, and one half teaspoon salt, and we're gonna add that to a mixing bowl. Now take your mixing bowl and whisk the flour together just so all the leavenings and the salts are mixed through the flour. And we can put that aside. I'm just going to shut the mixer off and scrape down the sides of the bowl just so we can speed up the process of the creaming. So the butters and sugars are lighter in color now. We can add one egg to the mix and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. And we're gonna mix this together just until it's combined. Now that the eggs and the vanilla are incorporated, we're going to take our flour mixture that we already blended, and we are going to add it to the mixing bowl. We're gonna start the mixer up on low. We want to mix the flour just until it's combined. You don't want to mix it longer because that will lead to a tough cookie. It's good. Next thing we're going to add to our dough is two and a half cups of rolled old fashioned oats. And we are also going to add two cups of dried cranberries. I'm going to go ahead and scrape the bowl down one more time before we mix it. And mix this on low again just until it's all combined. Okay, and our dough is ready to be baked. So we have our dough completed. We have our baking sheet prepped and ready. Now we're just gonna take it and portion out some cookies into about one and a half ounce each ball. Each ball is approximately the size of a golf ball. So this is about how far you want each cookie spaced out in your cookie sheet. And I, you should smash them down with your palm just so you get about a half inch disc for each cookie and now they are ready to bake. So we're gonna put these cookies in the preheated oven at 350 degrees for about 16 to 17 minutes until they're lightly browned on the edges. Let them cool off completely and then you'll have a nice crispy cookie at the end. So after we take them out of the oven, they've cooled off completely and we're looking for the nice light brown color on each of them and they are ready to eat and delicious. I'm Derek Jager, and I just showed you how to make thin and crispy oatmeal cranberry cookies. Thank you.